it's Cody. And Sanessa. We are so happy you chose to join us for worship. Yes, we are. Code, did you know that there is something new here on Bethlehem's property? No, I didn't. Mm. What uh, is new on the property? I am so excited. It brings me so much joy. Bethlehem has its very own <gasps> ga ga ball pit. Wow. For real. Do you remember playing at a camp? Yes, it's a pretty fun it's game. It's like the best game Intense. ever. Yes. So if you come to Bethlehem's property, bring a ball. It's like a kickball. Like that's the kind you need. And the ga ga ball pit is over kind of by the gardens near the big garage. You'll see it. It's beautiful. It is is seriously the best moment of my entire week. It's pretty cool. It is awesome. So if you notice in the announcement slides, uh, we put the highs and the lows question in there for you. So we hope that you saw them. They were, what makes you the happiest? Me this week, Bob Goggle Puppet. And also, what was something that maybe had you feeling sad or worried? So again, those questions from now on will be uh, in the announcements. So hopefully you answered them. If you didn't, we encourage you to do it at the end. Remember, that is the first step in the Faith Five. But for now, let's sing together Undignified. I will dance, I will sing to give praise for my King. Nothing, Lord, is hindering this passion in my soul. I will dance, I will sing to give praise for my King. Nothing, Lord, is hindering this passion in my soul. And I'll become even more undignified than this. Some may say it's foolishness, but I'll become even more undignified than this. Leave my pride by my side, la 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 la, hey, la 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 la, hey, la 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 la, hey, la 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 la. I will dance, I will sing to give praise for my King. Nothing, Lord, is hindering this passion in my soul. I will dance, I will sing to give praise for my King. Nothing, Lord, is hindering this passion in my soul, and I'll become. Even more undignified than this. Some may say it's foolishness, but I'll become even more undignified than this. Leave my pride by my side. La 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 la. La 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 la. Hey. La 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 la. Woo. La 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 la. Am I at the point of no improvement? What of the death I still dwell in? I try to excel, but I feel no movement. Can I be free from this unreleasable sin? Oh, never underestimate my Jesus. You're telling me there's no hope. I'm telling you you're wrong. Oh, never underestimate my Jesus. When the world around you crumbles, He will be strong. He will be strong. I throw up my hands. Oh, the impossibilities, frustrated and tired, where do I go from here? Now I'm searching for the confidence I've lost so willingly, overcoming these obstacles is overcoming my fears. Oh, never underestimate my Jesus. You're telling me there's no hope, I'm telling you you're wrong, oh, never underestimate my Jesus. When the world around you crumbles, he will be strong, he will be strong. I think I can't, I think I can, but I know you can, I know you can. I think I can't. I think I can, but I know you can, I know you can. Never underestimate my Jesus. You're telling me there's no hope, I'm telling you you're wrong. Oh, never underestimate my Jesus. When 
the world around you crumbles, you will be strong, you will be strong. Go ahead and grab those Spark Story Bibles as we take part in number two of Faith 5, sharing the word together. Our story tonight starts on page 276. Do not worry. Jesus loved to teach people about how God wants people to live. God takes care of us, Jesus said. Don't worry about what you're going to eat or what you might wear or when you'll grow taller. God will take care of these things for you. Look at the birds. Do they worry about what they eat? Of course not. God makes sure they have food. Look at the flowers. Do they worry about what color they are? Of course not. God made them each beautiful in their own way. And God makes you beautiful too. You're beautiful simply because you are you. Then Jesus said, Listen, there is far more to life than worrying. Worry gets you nowhere, so stop. The only thing you need to do is put God first. Trust that God will take care of you. Tonight in our story, we heard all about Jesus talking and sharing different ways that he and that God want us to live our lives. So one of the things uh, that they talk about is happy and joy and spreading that around to other people. So, Code, when you think of somebody in your life that is like super happy and super positive and always has really great things to say, who comes to your mind? Well, I think about my grandma, Diane. <laughs> Always his grandma. She's grandma. a really great lady. She is a really great lady. She is very kind and very thoughtful and always happy. Always happy. Mm -hmm. mm, I, uh, when I first read the story, I thought immediately of Kayla Kraus, uh, who's mm -hmm. another second grade teacher, also a member of our church. Uh, if you haven't met her, you should meet her. Yes. Uh, she is just always in the best mood. And if I ask her something about school, she's always got the greatest answer. And she just always seems to have everything together. Now, even though Grandma Diane is awesome, and even though mm -hmm. Mrs. Krause is awesome, they have bad days, and we have bad days too. And really, the last six months of our lives have all kind of been kind of dark and cloudy and gloomy, and mm -hmm. it's been really, really, really hard to focus on the good things. And so in our story tonight, Jesus just reminds us that when we see the birds and that we see the flowers, we have to remember that he takes care of us. He gives us everything we need. And if we can put our faith and our hope and our trust in the rock who is Jesus, we will be okay. We will feel happy. We will feel joy. The sun is going to come up. So for those of you out there that are maybe feeling a little sad, look for the flowers, look for the birds, look for the things, the Grandma Diane's and the Mrs. Krause's, or the candy bar, or the TV show, the breath of fresh air. Look for those blessings, those good things that Jesus gives us. And it will help remind you that you're not alone, mm -hmm. that we're in this together, and most importantly, Jesus has all of us right in the palm of his hand. Yes, yeah, so if you have your Faith 5 bag with you at home, we're going to make that lovely flower together. So you need your pudding cup, your Oreos, Yum. your green spoon, and then your pipe cleaner. And so we're going to start first by making some flowers. And so all I'm going to do is bend it half in on this side, give it a little twist. Nice. I'm going to smoosh your Take Oreos. Yeah, that would be great. Take the other side, give it a little twist. Boom. Half of the flower done. Beautiful, Code. Take the other half in, give a little twist. And then the main important part is putting the flower together on our stem with that last little piece of pipe cleaner right around the middle. Give it a fun little twist. And we have our flower. So you can remember when you look at those blessings like the flowers and the birds that don't worry as much because they know God's got them in the palm of their hand, you can be reminded as well. So take your pudding cup, take your smooshed up Oreos, and let's make the dirt that our flower grows in. What if I just poured it in my mouth? Oh, Yum. That would also I'm be not going to put all of the Oreos <laughs> in because I don't want it to get too full. There we go. And we it plant our little flower. Cute. Awesome. 
So remember all the time, this week and all weeks, that when you see the bird or the flower, that we can put our trust and our faith on the s in the solid rock of Jesus. Mm -hmm. And guess what, friends? It sounds a lot easier than it actually is. We know that, yeah. too. Everybody has bad days. But just the fact that we all have bad days together makes us a lot less alone. So hang in there. We got you. You got us. But Jesus has us all. We'd invite you into a time of prayer and sung response. We'll start by singing together, I will not let you go. No matter what. No matter what. are full of so many feelings. We're frustrated and sad and mad and sometimes it's difficult to feel happy. Help us to fix our eyes on you for you promised that you would never let us go. May we find comfort and warmth and peace in you. Thank you for giving us all the blessings. those people with small glimpses of happy, some care, and some extra love. We pray especially for all those who are sick, who are hurting, who are angry and sad or without hope. May your spirit provide some healing and some strength for all of them. We pray together. No matter what Our Father, who art in heaven, hallowed be thy name. Thy kingdom come, thy will be done, on earth as it is in heaven. Give us this day our daily bread, and forgive us our trespasses, as we forgive those who trespass against us. And lead us not into temptation, but deliver us from evil. For thine is the kingdom, and the power, and the glory, forever and ever. Amen. Thank you for joining in Bethlehem Lutheran Church at home worship today. All the ministries of Bethlehem are made possible by your prayer and financial support. 
I invite you to join me in gifting to Fund Bethlehem as we continue to be church together, both gathered and scattered. Online giving is one of the easiest and most convenient ways to support Bethlehem. You can even set up automatic recurring donations that make giving super simple. If you have any questions about how to set up online giving, please email me directly at mkukowski at bethlehemaberdeen.org. And we'll be posting a tutorial video that will be able to show you step by step how it works. We have had so much fun worshiping with you this evening. Next week, you will need a grown-up type of Bible. So not your Spark Story Bible, but a Bible that has all the chapters, both the Old Testament and the New Testament. And you will also need that shiny gold coin. Awesome. So as we close our time together, let's sing Trading My Sorrows. I'm trading my sorrow, I'm trading my shame, I'm laying them down for the joy of the Lord, I'm trading my sickness, I'm trading my pain, I'm laying them down for the joy of the Lord. We say yes, Lord, yes, Lord, yes, yes, Lord. Yes, Lord, yes, Lord, yes, yes, Lord. Yes, Lord, yes, Lord, yes, yes, Lord. Amen. I am pressed, but not crushed, persecuted, not abandoned. Struck down, but not destroyed. I am blessed beyond the curse, for this promise will endure. That his joy is going to be my strength. Though the sorrow may last for the night, his joy comes with the morning. I'm trading my sorrow. I'm trading my shame. I'm laying them down for the joy of the Lord. I'm trading my sickness. I'm trading my pain. Ow! I'm laying them down for the joy of the Lord. And we say yes, Lord, yes, Lord, yes, yes, Lord. Yes, Lord, yes, Lord, yes, yes, Lord. Yes, Lord, yes, Lord, yes, yes, Lord, amen. One more time, we say yes, Lord, yes, Lord, yes, yes, Lord. Yes, Lord, yes, Lord, yes, yes, Lord. Yes, Lord, yes, Lord, yes, yes, Lord, amen. Now, as step five of the Faith Five practices, we share and bless one another. So hear this blessing. Beloved child of God, may you feel loved and supported by this family and by God, the rock in whom we put our trust. Now share that blessing with one another. So go in peace to love and serve the Lord. Okay, we will. See you next Bye. time.